Southgate police and really much of the community on the lookout tonight for a stolen band trailer. The brand new storage unit was stolen from a school district parking lot, leaving the program scrambling. Rod Maloney has their story. For parents who have had kids in high school and they participated in a sport or the band, you know the Herculean effort that goes into fundraising to make it so that the experience is as good as you can make it for the kids. And so there's that sense of pride when they buy a new thing like, say, a trailer. There's also a larger sense of loss when somebody steals it. And the Southgate Anderson marching band. The Southgate Anderson Titans band is a local point of pride. The 80 students who join each year travel around the country and perform. They've been in America's Thanksgiving Day Parade and played at Ford Field. But moving a group this large requires trailers. They have three now after this scene in the last week. A security camera records the 3 a.m. theft of the trailer so new they hadn't even used it yet and it wasn't even marked up. Heartless, honestly, heartless. How do you take from kids? They've been through enough already with COVID. They've had their entire season taken. Their next season is taken. Who knows what the winter's gonna bring? So, I mean, I don't know how you can do this to a bunch of kids. The trailer itself cost about $6,000 and they'd loaded it with tarps, carts and props valued at about $5,000 back before a regional competition when COVID shut everything down. This is the children's trailer. They have worked their butts off to fundraise this money. We finally got something nice and new and somebody felt like they could take it from us. Band director Zach Novicki says his program will go on, but the missing trailer is gonna cause trouble. There will probably be some days where we ask parents to bring stuff in their cars instead of loading up a trailer because maybe the drum line or another program needs to use the trailers that day. So it's going to be it's going to be tough. So the trailer does have some insurance on it. The contents, none. So they're going to probably need a couple of years of fundraising to be able to replace this trailer unless somebody can find it. In Southgate, Rod Maloney, Local 4. Now, Southgate police are checking video surveillance cameras in the area. They're hoping for a better view of the red pickup truck that you saw in that video. If you know anything about this theft, call the Southgate police.